Jillian, today we are going to talk about our top five NPD resources that we think every NPD practitioner or department should have. And I want to start off with the quick guide series. I think that this is very important, especially for people like me who need to quickly access information about a specific topic and just be able to pull out what I need and then keep going. Love it. I would have to say one of my top five resources, Jen, is the scope and standards. And Maybe this Bible. goes without <laughs> this goes without saying this is our this is our primary go-to resource to guide all the things that we do, outlining our standards of practice, um, competencies for the NPD practitioner role. Our NPD practice model is in here. It walks you through each piece of that systems model. I mean, this poor thing has been through so much. Um, you can tell that it's it's well loved. <laughs> yes, I remember when I first got mine, uh, and I uh, on the plane ride home from Vegas, I sat there and read it and underlined all uh, like everything. <laughs> So very good book. The next thing I want to talk about is the Keep Me Out of NPD Jail book, my legal aspects book. And I can't tell you how helpful this has been in ensuring that I am doing things um, correctly and legally. Very, very important, but another must have for NPD practitioners. Yes, I love the stress on content integrity in legal aspects and also it touches on the legalities with student affiliation. So those academic partnerships too, um, such a good resource. All right, ooh, between the next two, it's a tie. Um, you can't go wrong with the core curriculum. I mean, look at this bad boy. This has everything related to NPD practice and talk about a wealth of wisdom and knowledge for all the contributors within each chapter. I mean, you wanna know more about anything from the scope and standards, this is your expansion of that, giving you tools, resources, um, really practical approaches to how you advocate, how you collaborate, how do you manage competency, educational design. I mean, I could keep talking, but- It is literally you don't have everything this, you need to know about NPD. So it is a great resource. Okay, my favorite book, and I might be a little biased because I absolutely, you know, I facilitate the Leadership Academy, but the Leadership in Nursing textbook, because I think it's such an essential role that we fulfill as NPD practitioners. So this book gives you all of the business acumen that you need to be able to convey the value of our specialty within your organization. So those are our top five picks for ANPD resources you should have in your department and join us next time where we will talk about five non-ANPD books that every NPD practitioner should have in their library.